Hello everyone, welcome to lab 6.4.1.2 from Big Data and Analytics course from Cisco. This course is about, or this video is to show you how to use Raspberry Pi with Python. Okay, so the Raspberry Pi camera setup, this is the name of this lab. And in, uh, in the background or in the scenario, you will physically install the camera model and uh, software and use Python to control the camera to capture and display images. Actually, here in what we need, we need one uh, computer and also we need one Raspberry Pi version 2 or higher and we use we need camera uh, version 2. Actually, I'm using camera uh, model 2. If you search on the internet Raspberry Pi camera model 2, you will find the version or the type or, or the camera I'm, use, I'm using. And uh, also we need Python libraries like Matplot and uh, IPython display and PyCamera and at that time. Uh, now, by the way, I'm using now the Raspberry Pi image and that you already uh, shown in the previous videos. And also you can use, if you don't have Raspberry Pi at home at the moment or you don't have it, then you can use the Google Cool App as we as, or I, as I showed you in the previous videos or in the lab. Okay, so in part one, we need to set up the camera. Actually, this is the cable of the camera and you can plug in in this way. However, you can find plenty of videos or the tutorials on how to install the camera on the Raspberry Pi. Actually, this is not the goal behind this video. And uh, the goal is to uh, use it with Python. At the end, after you installed it, then you need to restart the Raspberry Pi and then you start work with it. First, we need to test if the camera is ready. Then we import ipython.display. We need to import an image and then we import time. Okay, so let's import both of them. And then let's test the camera with this command. And as you can see, this command uh, can be used inside the terminal itself because this except lamination mark now and we tell them, like we are telling Jupyter to run this command as we run it through the uh, command line interface or through the terminal window, the plug window, I used to say like this. And then this is the Raspberry Pi uh, command and here we have uh, many parameters. And the last one is the output of the image or the frame that we are capturing. And O for output and T for time here. However, we have many uh, more uh, parameters. Uh, this is the one we use the T for the first one for the time, the W for change the image width on pixel. Here we change the height in pixels. And then for HF, it's a flip that it flips the image horizontally. VF flips the image vertically, vertically. And here we have the output and uh, for the last one here is for applying an image effect like, you know, um, Solaris sketch and so on. Okay, so let's check now the image. And this is the image now I am capturing through Raspberry Pi. Uh, okay, so then we can, for example, use it with changing the width and the height of the image. Okay, let's try this as well. Actually, now we should be clear. So from W what it does, H what it does, and this IFX what it does. And let's try to run this one. Still executing. Then let's take this one from here. And this one is the same, but with different width and height, and we our eye applied some um, effects on it. All right, now let's uh, capture on uh, images with Python. Until now, we captured the image with the command line interface, as you can one more time. Uh, this exclamation mark indicates this, but now let's capture it with 
a Python library called Pi Camera or Raspberry Pi Camera, whatever you want to set for it. First, we need to load the models required to display a camera um, image or images. Here, we import Raspberry Pi Camera model. We have a Pi Camera model. You can find a tutorial on it about the internet and uh, go and uh, expand your knowledge with this module. And then also we import, uh, uh, like from Pi Camera, we import Pi Camera itself. Let's see, I can hear it's not the same. Okay, then we configure the environment to display the matplot image on this notebook. So we put it in line, we give this command, and then we import the matplot uh, py, python plot model to refer to it as a plot. We import it this way, and then we import the ipython model to clear our plot and uh, methods. Alright, here we imported the models, then we uh, capture the image through this code. So first we need to try actually we need to make sure that the camera is closed If not, then we try to close it and then after that we initialize the camera by creating a camera object and it's uh, can, This step can be implemented in this way So we have the resolution of the frame that we are going to capture. We have the name of number of frames We uh, we are trying to do we need only one picture not video if we need the video then we make many frames here and then we also create an object for the captured image and then this is the object called raw capture. Then we need to a little bit make a, give us a warm up to the camera then we like to sleep for 0.1 uh, second and then we try to capture the frame and the frame is the format RGB which is uh, red, green and blue then it's going to be um, a colors for well, image with colors not only black and white and then we create an array from the captured image then this is the array and then we try to uh, plot uh, use the plot method uh, to for the image uh, where the graph is captured and then we implement the axis is off and then we give a name or title for the picture that we are going to capture and then we plot in i am image show and then plot show then we close the camera of course if any uh, think went wrong then we run an exception that close the camera and we say something went wrong all right so let's check now the code and as you can see now we have the same image but with a different resolution and now we capture it using python so this is the goal behind this video thank you very much and see you in the next video